You didn't think I was going to. There's a stopper on the bottom. Oh, Piggy. With Arco, you never have to break the bank. Arco, quality top tier gas for less. Yes, it's the word that dealers at Cerritos Auto Square say more than anyone to people looking to trade in their old car. And right now, there's never been a better time to trade in and trade up. Or just cash out by selling us your car. Choose from the world's largest selection of new, used, and certified pre-owned vehicles from 23 brands, all in one convenient location. So say yes to trading in your old car and trading up to a new one today. Cerritos Auto Square. KTLA 5's Frank Buckley shows you the side of newsmakers you rarely get to see. Frank Buckley interviews today at 2.30, only on KTLA 5. Go Gundo Go! We are just hours away from the Little League World Series where our local boys could become world champions. We're live with all the excitement. Plus, how do you show your love and affection? We break down the favorite love languages by state. You may be surprised at the answer for California. And we're going to be hot this week, as you can see from the seven day. We're going to talk about how long the triple digits will last coming up. And they are a new pop sensation, all under the age of 13, from Team JoJo Siwa, a special performance by XOMG Pop. That's coming up in Entertainment. Morning and welcome to the KTLA Morning News at 10 a.m. I'm Pedro Vera. And I'm Lauren Lister. We thank you so much for joining us on this beautiful Sunday. So exciting. We're going to yes. have these young pop stars perform. Yeah. We are all about highlighting youth achievement. We have the El Segundo Little League, 12 year olds. I was just thinking and then here are some 13 year old pop stars. Yeah, so it's the time to get your kids, uh, you know, if you want to get them into news, now is the time <laughs> to watch, okay? Uh, because it's going to be a great performance. Uh, one thing I'm curious about is our boys, they're playing in Williamsport. Yeah. They're playing for the big championship. So we're excited for that. Hopefully they get some good weather to go along with that. Oh, good if point. they were playing here today, it'd be yeah, perfect. Yeah, yeah. Casey, I wonder how the weather is going to be. Can we get like the, a Williamsport for this You want to see if we can like, get a camera for them? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> yeah, we, no, I just mean like Maybe what's the later, weather we looking get the like? I'll check for you. I'll yeah, check. Okay. Um, yeah, I've been focusing on our weather because it's going to be hot. <laughs> and right now we're seeing sunshine all across Southern California. Temperatures currently on this Sunday morning 74 Santa Monica, 78 in Santa Ana. It's already 84 in Chino, and it has warmed up to 81 degrees in Lancaster. Temperatures this afternoon, triple digits, 10. 104 for Chino, 104 for Riverside, 103 in Ontario, 104 for Van Nuys. You can see it's also going to be pretty warm for Santa Monica, 78 degrees for you today, and 89 in Santa Ana. And we'll talk about the rest of the week coming up. Back to you guys for now. Casey, thank you. Little League mania taking over Southern California. El Segundo will face Curacao today in hopes of being crowned world champs. Yeah, this comes after they beat Texas for the U.S. title. KTLA's Andy Rose Ramos is live in El Segundo, where the community <gasps> is supporting go the boys. Go. Oh, love this. Let's go, Gundo, let's go. 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 Woo! job guys i love it oh my goodness they are loud and proud here for let's go gundo Woo! all right ryan yes hello city council member hello, hello. with the, the city what a welcome yes um you know this is so exciting today is the day i know you had this is your idea back there they're setting up that screen for people to come watch tron on brett field since we couldn't fly the whole town out to Williamsport, we're bringing <laughs> Williamsport here to George Brett Field, Nel Segundo. I love it. I love it. This is, for folks who don't know and might be watching, this is a free event. They can come right out. That's right. That's right. The whole community is going to be here cheering on our champions. Amazing. Amazing. Now, I know that you were saying that the mayor is over there at in Pennsylvania, going to be there supporting the team. Yep. But you can feel how excited folks are here in this town. I mean, just anybody you talk to. Are, are gearing up and just waiting in anticipation for today. Yeah. But you know this team, you know about the coach, and, and for folks who might be at home, you know, tell us a little bit more about just how this team has worked their way up to, to world champions, well, possibly. Well, you, you can see it in the way that they play. You know, yeah. they're composed and they're still having fun out there. Wow. They're doing what they need to do. They don't make a lot of mistakes. But this is very much a baseball town, yeah. right? 
small town, families know one another, and we've seen these kids grow up on our baseball fields here, and we could not be more proud of everything they're doing. I mean, 12 years old, I don't know. I, I certainly wasn't vying for the world championship at 12, so this is just incredible. Um, you know, just an amazing team. We see up there they've got Little League. They were state champions just a couple of years ago, and now they're going out for the world championship. What, um, you know, I know they're coming home tomorrow, and you guys are preparing for that. There's yep. going to be a town parade. Talk a little bit about how the town is coming together just to celebrate this amazing, amazing feat. Well, you can just feel the electricity yeah. the entire week. You yeah. know, there isn't one of our breweries or bars that hasn't been completely full. Everyone's watching the same thing, cheering on these kids, and they've been doing incredible. We're so proud of them. This is so exciting. Well, congratulations, City Thanks Council member um, Ryan Baldino. Thank you so much. Thank congratulations, you. because they are winners, and you guys.